Miss Richardson, how long have you known Mr. Lyles? All my life. Since we Did you ever little... date? No. Just friends? Yes. On what night were you and Mr. Lyles hanging around and drinking? March 9th, 2017. He came to your house? Yes. What time of the day did you start this hanging around and drinking? Around like 10, 30, 11 o'clock. At night? Yes. Where had you been before Mr. Lyles? I had just flew back in from Las Vegas to Michigan. And so I was coming from the airport. Why did you go to her house? Because we were friends and we, we agreed to meet up once I came back. So you got there at 10.30? I'm not sure about what time it was. And what were you drinking? I don't really remember. This is like almost a year ago, so I don't know. Think about what Maybe a what? beer, like a Bud Light Platinum. And what were you drinking, Miss Richardson? Some 1800. What is that? Some tequila. And what time did you start drinking? About 9, 9.40. So you were drinking before Mr. Lyles got there? Yes. Who were you drinking with? By myself. Do you drink every night by yourself? Not every night. Most nights? <laughs> yeah. Oh, by the way, let me go back. He's having trouble remembering what he was drinking. Do you have trouble remembering what he was drinking? I mean, because you had been drinking since 9 o'clock. So now you've been drinking tequila for three hours. Do you remember what Mr. Lyles was drinking? Yes. What? 1800. So he was drinking tequila also? Yes. How did you get from the airport to her house? I drove. You drove what? My vehicle. Your car? Yes. And then you were going out. Where were you going, Mr. Lyles? Oh, well, you mean after I came from the airport or after I got with her? After you were hanging out with her, you left to go someplace, which is where this whole incident happened, in a car. Exactly. Where were you going? Um, at the time when we first got in the car, we didn't have a specific destination, but after being... Well, you were drinking, and she was smashed. So that would suggest to me, Mr. Lyles, that you were a little smashed, too, because if she's smashed, because she's been drinking tequila since 9 o'clock, mm -hmm. and you got into a car at midnight, and you don't know where you're going... It's... Well, it's not, it's not that we just got in the car and didn't know where we were going. It's just it was something as not as important that I, I can't remember to this day, but we had, like, maybe to a store, maybe to a gas station, maybe to a friend's house, a mutual friend's house. I want you to remember it. Well, I know for sure after, when we first got in the car, we got the call from her friend. Her friend wanted to pick her up, but this is after we had already been driving. So I know that we were on well, our way... just a second. Why were you driving her car? If you drove your car to her house and you were more sober than she was, why didn't you take your car? Because she was so quick to jump up, like, I'm out, I'm out, let's go. So she started driving her car at first, and she left, and I jumped in the car with her. Once I didn't like... What do you she... mean she... What do you mean she started driving her car first? Well, she, we, we were sitting in the house, you know, we were sitting in the house just conversating, and then she all of a sudden got the urge that she wanted to leave. So she got her keys and got to her car, and I got in with her. And after I didn't like how she was driving, then I took over and I started driving.